Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Grana Soja is the fifth celebrity to leave Dancing with the Stars. Grana and her partner John Nolan lost the dance-off after judges chose to save Jordan Conroy and Salome Chachua. Despite the TV presenter exiting the competition, it was an incredible night of performances as Dancing with the Stars celebrated Big Band Week. Each couple performed a mesmerising routine to live music as the RTE Concert Orchestra joined the show for one night only. The first couple to take the dance floor tonight was Grania and John. They danced to Cha Cha to Dancing in the Streets, earning a total of 19 points from the judges. Judge Arthur Gorulian told her, The key to a great Cha Cha is being fun and flirty with full on energy, and you definitely had that tonight. Well, Brian Redmond added, The girl next door definitely came out to play. Next up was Rugby Sevens, Jordan Conroy and Salome Chachua, who performed a fantastic contemporary ballroom to high hopes. They massively impressed the judges, who gave them a maximum score of 30 points, although still found themselves in the bottom two. Brian said, There are no high hopes be here because that was the high achievement all the way. It was brilliant. Third to dance was Matthew McNabb and Laura Nolan. After only scoring 12 points for their cha-cha last week and the couple had a lot to prove with the Paso Doble to live, to live and let die, Lorraine said it was a big success for Matthew and Laura and they got 22 points. After being in the dance-off last week, singer Erica Cody and Dennis Sampson bounced back with an energetic American smooth to Ella Fitzgerald to Don Hart. Arthur said, it must be hard for you because of last week, but you came back and showed us what you're made of. You took us to classic Hollywood and I was living for it. The couple scored 25 points. Jockey Nina Carberry and Pasquale La Roca turned up. The fun factor with a cheeky Charleston and scored 30 points for the second week in a row. Brian said, I think you missed your calling to achieve what you're achieving in just eight few months dancing. Can you imagine how good you would have been if you started as a child? Next to dance was swimmer Ellen Keane and Stephen Vincent. They performed a high-energy jive to Christina Aguilera's Candyman, which the judges loved. Lorraine Barry guessed that the couple blow her away every week, while Arthur said it was an incredible effort. Ellen and Stephen scored 27 points. The final couple to perform was Aslan legend Billy McGuinness and Hannah Kelly as they performed a samba to wedding classic Rock the Boat, which earned 18 points. Thanks for listening. Please like, comment and subscribe.